Hello everybody and welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Survivor. And from the last episode we defeated Dag and Gera. And now we're just bringing the compass back to Cordova. Step ten the lot. This one's a rare catch indeed. What is it? The fabled farfish. Its tail is one ribbon with greed, soaked to the bone with tragedy. There are scant few far left on account of their succulent glands. But I do not intend to harvest the poor creature for its organs. Okay. Alright. Uh, I'm going to meditate. Alright. Let's go. Yeah, we gotta get to Cordova. Well, actually... Before I go do something stupid, I should probably use the fast traveling system that is in the game. I can easily just fast travel back to my ship. Yes, travel. Yay, that saves us so much running. Hello, table. I gotta go somewhere. Yep, we are going back to Jeddah. Full speed to Jeddah. You think Cordova can repair that compass? Oh, I bet credits he can. You have credits to bet? What's that supposed to mean? <gasps> Tantalor. We're so close now. I'm yeah. excited to see Tantalor. Oh, me too. But just don't go starting a witch school or something. I definitely don't invite those creepy sisters of yours. But they're here now, Grease. All around you. I just sensed something, Grease. Did you feel that? Are you kidding me? Eyes <laughs> <laughs> uh, front, Cal. We're coming in. That's good. I love those landings. I just love seeing the ship traveling and landing and all the fun stuff. All right. Cordova, I have your compass. So we could travel the beach. Hello there. Master Cordova. Dagangara had the last compass, but it's damaged. He didn't exactly hand it over. This can be repaired. I'll begin at once. BD. That's good. Let's give Master Cordova some time to concentrate. I know a place with a view. Good. You know, it's kind of heavy if anybody wanted to give me a hand. Of course, Grease. Nice. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, ha ha, very funny. <laughs> oh. Okay, here you go, round two. What do you think? It's strong. It's very sweet. You'll get used to it. <clears throat> hey, Seer. Why don't you join us on Tantalor? There's no better home for the Archive or the Hidden Path. Whatever the future holds, we can face it together. Yes. 
It's a new path for all of us. Cal, Master T'Pol would be proud of the Jedi you've become. I had a good teacher. Everyone, the hidden path has found a new home. To Tantalor. To Tantalor. <laughs> hey, wait a minute, Seer. Does that mean you're coming? Yes, Grease. <laughs> In fact, I'm going to go and prepare the archive for relocation. Well, it's getting late. I'll go with you. Say, where is the Manus in there? This place is terrifying at night. I will escort you. Oh, great. Mm. But, hey, none of that creepy stuff, OK? <laughs> Seer, are the Anchorage really coming with us? Of course, yes. Wow, our family's growing with a boatload of creepy aunts and uncles. <laughs> This is like a really happy moment. We did it, Boat. Yeah. The compass is gonna be good as new. Something's bothering you. Ah, oh, you know me too well, Scrapper. Just thinking about Kata. And people looking after her, but it's always a bit tough when I come back. When she sees what you've done for her, she'll understand. I hope so. I was thinking maybe we should go to Ten War first. Just make sure it's safe before the others join. Mm, the sooner we get the hidden path set up there, the better. Gotta stay one step ahead of the Empire, right? Yeah. Hey. Tomorrow we're gonna have a new home. Couldn't have done that without you, Boat. Thank you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I love the character development between these I'm, two. Uh, <laughs> gonna go over Boat is a really good now. character. You have a good night. You've earned it. Now these two. <laughs> I can't wait to see where things go with these two. What a view, huh? Desert at night seems to stretch on forever. Hmm. And there is beauty and emptiness. Now you sound like a Jedi. I think of a few things, right? Not everything. Look, um, the order's gone. It's time to leave it behind. And I know what I want now. <laughs> that was just amazing. I loved every bit of that cutscene. Okay, great. I'm in a I'm in a in a place that I'm completely and utterly lost. I'm gonna check the map. All right, elevator. Okay. Cordova. 
How's it coming? See for yourself. Master Cordova. You did it. What? Imperial force is coming in from all sides. They found us. Get your people out. Hold them off as long as they can. Boat? I'm really sorry about this. Who? Oh. Son. Son, you don't have to do this. Cordova and why? Oh no, you traitor. Gonna get away from you, Bode. Not after what, what you, you did. <laughs> so many. Get off him. Ooh. I would admire that move, but I'm still pissed off at Bode. together and you're just gonna hand it to the empire i'm not giving it to the empire you killed master cordova cal you don't have time for this fight something terrible is coming for that archive listen to your instincts you know i'm right what have you done if you want to keep your family safe you get them out of there right now what have you ah! done what? You can't be. You're not the only one who survived. Ah. Uh. Food?
You're done for both. I'm taking down Inquisitors. What are you? I'm playing a seer now? Hold them back. They cannot reach the archive. <laughs> Holy crap, Seer is an extremely powerful character. Seer is an extremely powerful character. I just can't get over that. Oh. Marin, you're all right. Yes, but the Empire is attacking the main gate. Okay, I'm gonna pause here because this is definitely something else going on entirely and that last episode, I mean, this episode has just been mind-blowing so far with Bo's, Bode's betrayal. Okay. I need to collect my thoughts. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no, so much bad stuff has happened. Alright, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. Bye bye <laughs>